like to make more here welcome to my YouTube channel. Now before I will continue with my Pokemon goals, I'm a bit stuck for quite about an hour right now with the Almanite puzzle and I've tried to you know redo it twice. This is going to be number thrice and the problem is is the puzzle is confusing as fuck so what I'm now gonna do is I'm gonna cut this episode in multiple parts because I don't have fucking time mind my language to waste on getting that puzzle fixed now either way I have to get that puzzle done but I don't want to have an episode which could have happened twice already where it takes me about an hour total thus far in order to get that puzzle done and even then was not done I don't want that kind of gameplay on my video on my youtube channel because you know that's unnecessary bullshit um, you know bullshit content if you will however on the road towards it I do come across some trainers which is what I have to record so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to go to the area and I'm going to get myself uh, which Pokemon's Graveler and my Tokitik for Rock Smash and Strength which I need for the Ho-Ho puzzle and the Omanite puzzle and I'm going to get to those areas part 2 will be the Omanite puzzle um, I'm not quite sure whether part 3 or 4 will be the ho ho puzzle but I'm gonna cut them out of my episodes not because I want to but because it sometimes takes me decades in order to figure out how to complete that puzzle Kabuto puzzle was very easy Aerodactyl puzzle took me already an hour eventually I had that done but that one all the unnecessary bullshit was still in the same fucking episode I don't want that shit on my YouTube channel so I'm gonna cut it into parts maybe edit it together later probably not I'm just gonna you know upload but do not worry even if they are cut in parts I will make sure that um, you know if let's say episode 50 part 1 is uploaded publicly at let's say 1 p.m you know then the part 2 and part 3 will follow relatively short afterwards you know like let's say 115 or 130 depends on how many parts uh, parts that specific episode had as well as is it intentionally done or not you know if it's uh, two parts of 30 minutes well that's the reason why it's in two parts you know if it's in five parts with 10 10 10 10 10 you know then the reason is I had to, you know, prevent certain things from taking away gameplay hours. So I'm doing this for you guys, not for myself, because either way I have to get through that shit. Not once, not twice, but thrice. Namely Pokemon Gold, Pokemon uh Pokemon Silver, the you know, no commentary version, which is this one, Pokemon Gold, Silver with commentary and a hardcore run which will be crystal yeah I still have to beat all three of them so I do have to get them done eventually you know but I as it with the recording bullshit part I can prevent this from going to my YouTube channel and let's say take an hour before I figure out how to f complete the Omanite puzzle so what I'm technically gonna do is I'm gonna record as I'm currently doing walk to pass those trainers go to the Omanite puzzle first or the ho ho puzzle remains to be seen and I will quickly save before that before I will do that stu those stupid puzzles and then you know do the puzzle in the next part if the puzzle is completed then I will go to, in to another next part in order to walk to the next area or do in the same one as with the ho ho that remains to be seen and then the next part you know will be the omenite puzzle because I don't want you guys to look up on a screen unless it's absolutely necessary right now like now you know 
on me being confused with getting the picture done. Now, certain games on the emulators, like Banjo Kazooie, also have those mini games, but they not work efficiently, or they have, uh, you know, complicated issues that makes it a whole lot harder to complete them. Default game, it's crystal clear, you know, on the emulator. Let's face it, with Banjo, it's really fucking hard to see what's happening on the uh, image if you will Pokemon Gold that's not the case but I'm just stuck and confused with the Omanyte so without further ado let's just get into it cut this video into parts which will happen I have no choice I've already tried to avoid that twice and I'm not gonna do that a third time so you know I just cut it into parts to prevent you guys from uh, watching unnecessary content bullshit as well as either way I have to get past it you know so and then I could take my fucking time with it basically so uh, just let's just continue and uh, if you like what you see don't forget to subscribe and all that bullshit you guys know what to do I'm certain of it help me to get the, the, to that 1000 subscribers so that I can get money out of this and uh, use that money 90% of it, whatever the income may be, everything above 1,000 euros will be reinvested. So let's say if I earn 2,000, 90% of that 2,000, well, 1,000 actually, because you know I need 1,000 to feed myself, to pay my stupid bills, and all that bullshit. Of that 1,000 that's left, that I have over earned, if you will. I will use 90% of that to reinvest into thumbnails, creators, intro, outro designers, time stampers, and as soon as I make 10,000, 50,000 a month, the more I make, the more jobs I will fucking create because it's about fucking time that we enter the new era. But with that being fucking said, sorry for my language, let's just continue, cut this bullshit into parts, and uh, get this fucking over with. So uh, yeah, without further ado, let's go. I also forgot to mention that, uh, as you can see, because of the fact that I had to reset my Pokemon playthrough, you know, well, not my playthrough, but the uh, recording, because I was stuck with the Omni puzzle, I'm standing at a diff totally different location than where my last episode ended, which was with the uh, unknown area, you know, the, the cave where you can locate the unknowns. And now I'm standing in front of the box, which could confuse you guys, but you didn't guys, didn't miss much. The only thing that you missed is 5 minutes, give it a take, of walking. Uh, at max, you know. Um, the problem is with emulators, if you switch boxes it will automatically save you know whether it's on emulator or not it still does that but uh, because of that you know I have a bit of a uh, time jump if you will but uh, yeah let's just get 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 this uh, good. let's just get this fucking done <laughs> before I'm losing my mind because uh, currently I'm kind of so pitch Thank you. 
so what I'm now gonna do is I'm gonna save don't get confused I'm gonna go into invisibility mode if you will which means stopping my recording get the puzzle uh, the puzzle say my completed after saving I will complete the puzzle on one piece um, apart you know apart from one piece and then hopefully if I'm correctly I will start the recording again once I fill in the last piece so I can show you guys which piece belongs where clean efficiently and then instantly go to out of the unknown cave uh, go towards ho ho get that puzzle done and then catch all the remaining unknowns my sincere apologies for the inconvenience that I have to do it through this but if it takes me an hour hour and a half two hours maybe even maybe it will only take me 10 minutes who knows but I don't want to have much of unnecessary needed contents unless absolutely necessary like moments like this but um see you guys in a part two basically where we will finish the uh, omni puzzle go to the uh, ho ho puzzle repeat the same just to prevent you know f um, you guys from wasting a lot of time with watching me being confused on which piece goes where you know it already happened for like an hour in total with the omni puzzle I reset it twice I thought I figured it out reset it you know redo read it or commentary part re went through that specific location and then I got confused again and it took me another half an hour so in about an hour in total you know so uh, be right back technically speaking now I'm not entirely sure whether I will upload this in part 1, part 2, part 3 or edit them together probably I'm gonna you know upload them separately because it's just easier that way it's not that I'm lazy it's just I want as many you know videos out there as I possibly can and editing things together the rendering etc takes time as well and I prefer to prevent those unless I, again absolutely necessary like with an intro or an outro or things like that but anyways guys see you in part two sorry for the inconvenience but trust me when I say it's for your good because sometimes like the omnite puzzle it can take me a very long time before I figure it out to get that fucking puzzle completed and uh, I just want to not bore you guys with my uh, confusion which happens not that often thank the gods for that one but it does happen so uh, be right back guys don't forget to subscribe and all that fine stuff and uh, help me to get to that 1000 subs and I will guarantee you guarantee you guys everything that I make above a thousand everything whether it's two thousand three thousand four thousand you name it if I earn everything more than 1,000 a month, I'm going to sacrifice 90% of my income. Anything above 1,000. Why 1,000? Because I currently need 1,000 in order to survive in this shitty ass world that we call home today, you know. It's not that I want it, but it's how our system is built. I do need food, I do need to pay my electric bills and all that nonsense because otherwise I can't do the recording and all that fine stuff, you know. So if you can get me to that 1000 subs, that would be much appreciated and if I start earning money, everything that's gonna be above 1000 a month, which is gonna be relatively hard slash easy, it depends on how you look at it because I do have a lot of videos online. If I earn anything above 1,000, 90% of my income will be reinvested firstly and foremost into, you know, hiring people to make thumbnails for my playthroughs uh, for my YouTube channel or channels. Maybe I will make other channels in the future, who fucking knows. Everything that I will do is all inclusive. You know, if I have a gaming channel, a conspiracy channel, let's say, 
and a uh, education channel, whatever, you know. All of them combined will fund my, um, you know, my well-being and my status quo of keep doing what I'm doing. Now, currently I'm only doing gaming. But I am thinking about doing other subjects, like, you know, talking about ancient cultures and that kind of, that kind of shit. But, these things, you know, cost me time, a lot of time, and without the time, well, without the time, I cannot convert that time into a legitimate job time that actually pays. Because currently, I'm getting paid by the government, and they're not doing it because they find my plan so goddamn good because they don't have a clue you know the governments are not that really not that smart they're a bit outdated you know they're a bit ignorant but we'll buy through it i'm working on it being capable of working on my own through the government you know bullshit nonsense by being self-employed if you will but then doing youtube but I uh, get me to that 1,000 subs, everything that I earn, and it's, it, this is a guaranteed a promise, whether I earn 2,000 a month, 10,000 a month, 100,000 a month, or even millions a month, 90% of what I make will go back straight into the community, first and foremost into people that are supporting my channel by giving me thumbnails, which will increase my click-through rate, etc., you know time length time links which will give me less a minute watched through but will help players out with you know skipping unnecessary bullshit as well as hiring people to make intros and outros for my youtube videos my playthroughs my let's plays whatever you want to call them first and foremost for the hardcore runs but if i make enough Trust me guys, I'm really, really prepared to re-upload every single video that I currently have, which is about 2,000, with an intro and an outro. I'm gonna pay people to support my channel, and once that has been done, once my jobs, quote-unquote, are drying up, which will be very, very hard since I upload four videos a day, but it's possible, then, or I make a lot of money, you know that's also a possibility to get to this point if that is the case either way i'm gonna also reinvest the same money into smaller channels that earn nothing whatsoever because youtube is ignorance they just don't want you to, you know they don't want you to pay they, they just they just don't what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna build a company technically speaking search for advertisers and use those advertisers to get through out my entire you know on my channels obviously as well as everyone that will be below me because it's about time youtube twitch and all that bullshit is being torn open for those that seek it and it's about fucking time people are getting paid for their work from the get go because you know this shit doesn't make themselves, you know. This cost me hours and hours and hours, 80 to 100 hours weekly of work that I could normally have invested into, you know, a legitimate job, let's say. But then again, with the EU rules, the max amount of hours that I could work under the government is 40 hours, you know. So I still work double, yet they still don't give a shit. They they have no clue on what YouTube is, they don't have clue on how people make money on YouTube. They're, you know, behind, if you will. But uh, too much talking already, so uh, go to part 2 if you want to see the uh, Omanite puzzle bullshit. If you don't, well, you can go to the next episode, which is where we will continue the hunting for the unknowns. Um, whether it will take me one two three four five parts i don't know probably gonna take me three parts but who knows anyways guys support my channel get me to the top and uh the more i make the more i will respend not because i want to have a nice house a nice car and all that shit 
No, I don't give a slightest fuck about all that shit, nor do I give a shit about the thing, which is why it's prefer to be anonymous, you know. If people Google my Kitamemo, they can find my my real name, etc. I don't give a shit about that either. But it's not that I want to become famous for spreading wealth or whatever, you know. I don't give a shit about that. All I'm doing is tearing YouTube open for myself, first and foremost, and then for my fellow YouTubers that wish to do the same, especially those that are getting paid zero for their work. And um, especially, and most importantly, for the generations to come because they knew they need these jobs because IE is replacing us relatively rapidly and if we do not have alternatives well then humanity millions will be unemployed unable to feed themselves and uh, that will stir up chaos and all that bad stuff you know so uh, Subscribe to my channel, hit the like button, and all that shit. If you want to have hardcore runs of specific games, smash those like buttons of those specific games. If you want to see a hardcore run of, let's say, Pokemon Crystal in this particular case, well, then like Pokemon Gold, Silver, or Crystal. Obviously, well, Crystal is going to be the hardcore run, so Gold and Silver. If you want to have a hardcore run of Yellow, well, then you have to like the videos of Pokemon, oh, Pokemon Yellow, Pokemon Blue, then you have to like the, uh, you know, videos of Pokemon Yellow and uh, Pokemon Red, however, only one video counts towards the total number, just like my Gothic overall, you know, since Gothic and multiple parts, it require more likes, but uh, Pokemon's case, 100 likes, same with Gothic, now I'm thinking about it. But, I talk way too fucking much, let's just get into part 2, my sincere apologies for too much talking, support my channel and I will support you back 10 times fold, and together we're gonna take humanity into a new era, which is the era of home employment, because I know there are thousands of YouTubers out there that are putting a lot of work into this, their YouTube channels, their gameplay videos, you know, all that, all that shit, and they earn absolutely nothing from it, while YouTube makes millions out of them, millions, if not billions, if you combine all the videos combined, they don't even percent pay one percentage of the total income that they make, trust me. YouTube is making a lot of money, well, Google is making a lot of money, well, Alphabetic Inc. is making a lot of money. And I don't want you to benefit from it, so support my channel and I will break that motherfucker open for me, for you, and for everyone that wants it. Because even if you tear it open, not everyone will do it. Just trust me, mentally, it's fucking tough. Unless you're getting paid, but from the get go, then it's uh, a dream job, guys, a dream job. Anyways, see you guys in the next episode slash part this particular case part and uh, peace out